Okay, today we're going to make our spring thread tree. These are the things you need, um, but we're going to start off with just our tree. Clear these out of the way. So we need a trunk or a piece of cardboard, roughly this shape, and a piece of thread of kind of a, a brown bark colour. Just going to get mine off here. Right, there we are. That's what we're going to start with. Let me get some solid tape. And we're going to we're going to stick one end of the thread to the back, and then we're going to wrap the thread all around the bottom half of the tree trunk. You don't have to cover it all, it just gives the idea. And when we get to the end, make sure that's at the back again. Get the sellotape and stick the end so it doesn't move. Okay. And then the next thing we're going to need is a shape like this. This is our tree crown. Looks a bit like a flower. Again, if you don't have our pack, you just need cut a piece of cardboard, thick cardboard out in a rough kind of cloud shape. And for this one, because it's spring, we're going to use three different shades of green, but you can use whatever you've got. So the first green is this here, and we're going to do exactly the same. We're going to stick through end to the back just like this and then we're going to wrap it around our crown using the indents to secure it And then when you get to the end, I'm going to stick it down and then move on to the next piece. And do exactly the same, stick the end down, wrap it around, try and make it different ones and it should show through. Okay bit long so I'm going to just trim that off and get some more sellotape and secure it down. Like that. And then finally I'm going to do exactly the same again. out of the way. I'm going to start on the next bit which is with our blue piece of card and our green strip of card. I'm going to get the glue and I'm just going to stick the green bit to the bottom of the blue bit. Just like that. And then trim off any 
bit that sticks out. Now, if you want to make it a little bit more fancy, you could snip the top. And then it looks a little bit like the grass is growing in the springtime. Next, we need our trunk. I'm going to put lots of glue on the back. Make sure it's the bit with the sellotape on. That's the back. And then you're going to stick your trunk. So some of it goes into the green and the rest goes up into the blue. Then the next trick you might need an adult to help you with. So we're going to get a double backed piece of sellotape so that it's sticky all the way around. I'm going to roll the sellotape so that it's sticky both sides. And I'm going to put that at the top of my trunk to then stick my crown on. There we have our nice tree. We're then going to get some tissue paper and you can either use white or pink or both. And this is going to be your blossom. So we're going to screw it up into little balls and put a bit of glue on the thread and stick it on the tree. Just like this. I'm going to have white blossom in mine. They don't need too much. There we are. Okay, and the final thing, we're going to get our little white piece of paper. I'm going to cut some little clouds out. And clouds can be any shape and any size, can't they? So there's one cloud. Spring thread tree.